Hello guys, Pulse is back, the add-on is back, allowing you guys to get loads of movies and TV shows for free. If you guys want it, make sure you guys stay tuned for this video, and I'll show you guys how. Hello guys, Celeste here, welcome back to the channel. If you guys are new here, make sure you guys do me a big favour, smash that like button down below, hit the subscribe button too. Today guys, I'm going to show you guys how you can hold a pulse. It has finally just come back, it was a great add-on for, for a Cody build that you guys can help watch for yourselves. Some movies and TV shows and even some live events too. So all that thing guys, without further ado then, let's jump straight into it. The first thing we want to do is open up Cody, um, I'll see you guys there. Okay guys, perfect, once you're here, the first thing we want to do now is jump over into your settings tab right at the top, click on this one, and then go onto your system settings like this, and then go down to your add-ons, and then make sure that your unknown sources is checked on, otherwise you won't be able to get all of that third party content. Okay, once you got it, press the back button, go back, go down to file manager, go up to add source, click on this one, like this, then go up here for the pathway, click on this. I want you guys to type in this exactly correctly, otherwise it just won't work. So HTTP colon forward slash forward slash fire TV guru dot net forward slash fire just like that and then hit enter hit ok then the name you guys name it what you want but for the sake of the video I'm name it is dot pulse that's what we're here for ok and then hit ok alright now you can press the back button again go again now I want you to go down on the left hand side to add ons click on this one Ignore all this guys at the minute, this is from a previous build, but it's okay, so click on the add-ons one here, click on that. At the top left here, click on the drop box, this one here, click on that. Go over now to get to install from zip file, click on this one. Okay guys, once you're here, go down to whatever you named it as, um, for the sake of the video, I named it as .pulse, so just click on that one, there we go, and then hit on the top one, fireguru.zip, that's what you want. And up here in the top right in a second, it's going to download for you, that's what you want. And then click on install from repository now. Click on this one. And then I want you guys to go down and you're going to try and find the repository you just downloaded. So it should be Fire Guru. Let's have a little look. Here we go. This this is the one. Now you're, you're probably going to have a lot of uh, a shorter list than me. But for the sake of the video, um, that's what it's called. So it's Fire TV Guru Repo. Click on this one. Click on Program Add ons. Go down to get to Fire TV Wizard. Click on this one. Then install. Okay, perfect, once we got it, and then this is going to pop up, you can hit dismiss, and then this is going to come up, now whatever you want, you can check on whatever you want, uh, for the sake of me, I find that the last three is uh, really, really good, so put them in for me, and then hit continue. When this guy pops up, you can just click whatever you want, uh, for the sake of the video, I'm just going to press hit continue, just like that, and then I'm going to go on build menu, click on this one, okay, once you're here, Want to go down and go on 17.0 Paul CCM Krypton version 17.11.2.0. Now I know that we're currently on the 17.6, uh, but it's okay, it's all gonna work. So click on this one here, the middle one, click on that one, then go on fresh start, then install. Click on that, then hit continue. Main guys, let just let it just do its thing. Um, it's gonna go fast or slow dependent on, on your own internet speed, but I'll see you guys in a second. Once it's done, just be patient. There you go guys, it's just going to install again, don't worry about it, just let it just do its thing. Okay guys, once this page comes up, just hit OK, and it's going to force close Cody. There we go. Now guys, again, don't worry about it, that was supposed to happen. Just open up Cody again, and I'll see you guys there. Okay, there we go guys, I just opened it up. And now at the minute, the bottom right, it's just going to add on loads, and we're just going to do loads and loads of updates for you. Um, be patient with it, obviously for this at this point in time, it's going to be the first time that you've opened up this build um, as of the new update. So, just allow it to string all the things together allow for all the custom thumbnails to come in so just give it about four or five minutes just so it can uh, do everything it needs to do and then it'll be working perfectly for you so guys as you can see there's loads of things on there you've got movies sports tv shows and kids section and it's all going to be working nice and great for you guys um for the movies we got some elysium death streams and things like that so uh, I know the quality is going to be pretty, pretty good for you. Alright guys, but that's it for me today. So if that helps you out, make sure again you do me a big favour. Smash like button down below and the subscribe button too. Okay guys, till next time, I'm out.